And we're back this time with El Yucateco, the black one. It's called Salsa Picante de Chile Habanero, Black Label Reserve. Some of that on this spoon. See, it is somewhat thick. It's very black. Great habanero flavor. Xanthan gum. All right. Now we have Tears of the Sun hot sauce. This is from High River Sauces. Tears of the Sun. And memory serves, this one's going to be pretty fruity. Let's give it a go. Yeah, it's got little chunks of fruity materials there. Quite a sheen, orange color. Nice flavor. Apple cider vinegar, pineapple, pe peaches, papaya, mango, orange, habanero, pepper, water, brown sugar, lime juice, ginger, salt, garlic, and crushed red pepper. That one could probably have gone further back. Okay, now I'm holding in my hand Elijah's Extreme Reaper Sauce. This one is very tasty. It's almost gone. It's a blend of black cherries, cranberries, and Carolina Reapers with a splash of Kentucky bourbon. So really unique sauce here. See the deep color. And you just get the cherries and bourbon. <coughs> Good amount of heat to it as well. Okay, here's another one from Elijah's Extreme, their normal ghost pepper sauce. Give this one a try. Yeah, the heat is building. Okay, this one here is called Rogue. It is a Maruga Blood Orange Scorpion pepper sauce. Also almost gone, I've had this one a while. Okay, you can see the little particulates there, the sheen, bright red color. Wow. You get that orange zing to it, and it's quite wickedly hot, actually. Okay, next one. Primo's Pepper Swampadelic. Now this one was the 2016 Golden Chili winner and the 2017 winner of the Fiery Food Challenge. So you can go to zestfest.net to look that up. Okay. Ooh, I got a lot on my spoon here. Wow. That's intense. Oh. Okay. Next one. Scorned Woman Hot Sauce. If memory serves, this one has quite a lot of black pepper type flavor. Man, they just keep coming out. Look at this. Yeah. Vinegary, black peppery, a whole lot of heat. 